Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to put wheels on my little chicken tractor I built. Uh, let me turn the camera around. So I have been just dragging this across the yard. Uh, it's starting to get heavy and it's aggravating trying to get the metal on the back to slide in the grass. I went to tractor supply this morning and I picked up two wheels it's got the the bearings should have got a little bigger ones but I cheaped out got two carriage bolts a nut and a washer now when you get your wheel let me get let me do this one when you pick the wheel out that you want you need to get your carriage bolt to where it fits your wheel almost perfectly. That way it's not wobbling on you. You can get all this at tractor supply. I think two carriage bolts, two washers, two nuts. The wheel was $26 after taxes. Uh, Let's get started. Now first, you want to pick, I picked the back of it up and I set it up on a little brick to give me a little ground clearance so I can tell how, how far up I want to put my wheel from the ground. You don't want to go too high where a coon or something can crawl up under the back of your, that thing pecked me, up under the back of your chicken tractor and get your chickens. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do after you get your coop up off the ground a little bit is you're going to want to get this board you're going to use and you're going to want to put your wheel i wish i had a tripod uh, you're going to want to put your wheel get your wheel set to the height that needs to be and i've already did this um and you're going to Put your drill bit through the center of your wheel and mark your board. Just drill a little bit and then you can take it down and see that's where I need to drill my hole for my carriage bolt. Your carriage bolt is going to have that right there. Looks like a nut on the inside of it. So this is flat. You can't get a hold of that with nothing. Take your carriage bolt, put it in your hole, take a hammer and beat on it. And if you look, the nut part is down in the wood. That's going to hold your carriage bolt while you're tightening up your nut on this side. Now I got a little bit, my carriage bolt's a little bit too long. See, so I'm going to drop my wheel on there. I'm going to have to spray it. Drop my wheel on there. Then I'm going to take my washer. Put it on there. I'm going to take my nut. You're going to thread it on there. And as you tighten that. You don't have to hold this side because it's in the wood. And that's going to let that roll. How it's going to look once you get it on there. I've got an upright board going through here. I put a screw here. No board here. Got a 2 by 4 frame around the bottom on the inside of this metal. So I put three screws into it. Solid. You're going to put your wheel on. Tighten your bolt up. Okay guys, I'm here at the front of the coop. Got me an eye bolt, drill bit, a little smaller than the eye bolt. Pre-drilled me a hole. Putting it in the front of my coop so I can put a rope on it. I can pick my coop up, 
I'm going to find something to put on the inside of those wheels. I wasn't thinking. I need something to keep the wheels back off of the wood a little bit. But we're going to see how it works right now. Get that twisted in there. You guys hungry or something? Probably be easier to get a screwdriver and put through there, but... That would work for now. I'll show you the wheels. Say, so I need to get something to uh, keep the wheels off of the wood. Left a small gap in the back. Got both the wheels on. I'm gonna put the rope on, try to get the camera set up so you guys can see if it works. All right, guys. I mean, I'm gonna have to get uh, get something to put on that rope so it's easier on your hands. That does hurt a little bit. Here's their old spot. Here's the garden. Here's the new spot. They're already loving that fresh grass. <clears throat> but yeah guys I would suggest I'm going to go back and do it get something a few washers anything I don't know I'm going to have to ask to put between your board and your wheel keep it off your board make it easier to pull but that was a that was a very easy pull thanks for watching guys like and subscribe. Have a good day.